In this tutorial, we'll show you how to set up your NQA decoder with Tidal, Rune and Ordovana. We'll be using the Neo IDSD to demonstrate. If you're on Windows, please ensure you've installed your iFi drivers first. You can follow our driver tutorial if you need to set this up. First, open Tidal. Go to Settings, then Streaming. Ensure streaming audio quality is set to Master. Then go to Sound Output and select your MQA decoder on the drop down list. Go to More Settings and tick all three of these settings. This will allow your device to bypass the decoding done in Tidal and allow your device to do both the decoding and rendering. Select an MQA track and you'll now be decoding and rendering MQA. First, open Room. Go to Settings, then Audio. If you've not used this device before with Rune, then you'll need to enable this. Then press the cog icon and go to Device Setup. On MQA Capabilities, select Decoder and Renderer and press Save. Select an MQA track and you'll now be decoding and rendering MQA. First, open Ordovana. Press the speaker icon and switch to ASIO. Then press the arrow on your device and this will bring up extra settings. Then under DAC not detected as MQA, select MQA decoder. This will default the device as both an MQA renderer and decoder. Press the cog in the top right and go to streaming. If you're using Tidal as your music library, then ensure that the audio quality is set to master. Select an MQA track and you'll now be decoding and rendering MQA. If you have any questions on installing drivers or changing your firmware, please don't hesitate to contact our support team at support.ifi-audio.com.